Well, we are joined, joined by uh, Mr. K. Sivan, uh, ISRO chief, uh, on the phone line with us. Uh, Mr. Sivan, thank you so much for speaking with us. Really appreciate you taking out the time. A very crucial moment, uh, about 12 hours to go for that historic feat to be achieved. You, some days ago, sir, went on to say that uh, when the landing does take place, it is going to be a terrifying moment. Please elucidate for our viewers. What did you mean by that? Now, mainly because uh, this 15 minutes is uh, totally new to us, the, the sense that is uh, around the velocity of 1.6 uh, kilometers per second velocity has to be reduced to zero. At the same time, that the environment is a very harsh environment, which is also known, known to us. Under those conditions, without uh, much knowledge, that is uh, about the environment, we are reducing the velocity, uh, reduce. With the, the, the many systems, the, the trust will be very, as per the requirement, the many center, onboard system, navigation, guidance, control, avionics, everything has to work in a single to achieve the whole mission successfully. And that's what we are calling, it's the first time such type of mission we are going to do. And that's what we are calling the, the, the 15 minutes of uh, terrifying moment. That's what we are calling this one. Now, Mr. Sivan, you know, it's it's a historic moment. Uh, the logistics are going to, in fact, get expedited and the mission is going to be a success. But, you know, also, sir, if you concur with the fact that the South Pole has uh, been chosen because it's been untouched by sunlight for billions of years and offering an un, you know, disturbed record of the solar system's origin also. So there is another facet to look upon, which is, you know, we also will have a glimpse into how the Earth evolved through this mission. Yes. Yes, definitely. That's what we selected the place where that, uh, which nobody else has gone. This particular uh, region of interest is now special to scientists that they are eager to know what is the, the, the many, many secrets, secrets may be, uh, revealed by going to this place. That's what uh, not only that uh, now we are initiated that activity, we are the first person to do the work. Now that many countries are also focusing towards this particular uh, area. And even NASA is looking for uh, that uh, human landing at this place. That way, I would say that we are the first person to reach the place and understand about the system and science about the place that we will get. That way, this particular mission is not only of interest to India, the entire world is looking for this particular mission. He can, he can. And so, the, the, the long-term goal of, uh, you know, this very unique mission is the fact that exploration has to be done by Pragyan. And helium-3 is one of the minerals which has to be explored and eventually at some point in time in the future even brought back because nuclear energy for nuclear reactors is the future of energy. Yes, that is... Uh it may give some information about that, but uh, unfortunately, we are not in the process of coming back. So maybe it, it may give more data about that particular uh, mineral. That, that I'm sure that we'll get uh, this one. And so the long-term goal is also to make the moon, uh, you know, as, as a hub for space exploration yes. because it's only ha it yes. only has one-sixth of the Earth's gravity. So taking off from the moon is going to be a lot easier for rockets as compared to the Earth. Now, this uh, the, actually that is the uh, because of the gravity less that is uh, it will be the taking of the moon will be the easier. Also, it will be that it will be used as a hub for the the, the outer space travel. That is the thing that the human kind is now looking for, and uh, the, for that that the required the fuel. Yes, the water is available. The required fuel can be generated and uh, it can be used for, for uh, space travel from that place. That way, this, it can be used as a hub, this one. This so, one. so the preparations for Gaganyan are also underway. Uh, what kind of an effect, what kind of a contribution will Chandrayaan 2's successful completion have on, uh, uh, you know, the Gaganyan mission as well? No, Chandrayaan will not give any input to the Gaganyan mission because the Gaganyan mission, the objectives and the mission plan itself is totally different. That is to launch a man to the space. That is the Gaganyan thing. Whereas here we are talking about a technology to land on uh, for the, for the moon on a 
celestial body. Subjects are different, so this this data will not be useful for I mean, will not be used in the Gaganian. But Gaganian have its own complexity, difficulties, all those things are there. This one. And so, okay. considering that ISRO's budget for this mission was, uh, sir, perhaps one twentieth of USA's NASA, this is not only a success story because this was achieved in a thousand crore, uh, you know, moon mission, which is less than a Hollywood blockbuster movie, which is the Avengers Endgame. Uh, you know, we have not only made history, but we have also set very, uh, you know, high standards, strict standards for other space agencies across the world as well, sir. Yes, definitely. That is uh, uh, only when others are telling that we are spending in this, we are understanding. Otherwise, we are habituated to spend lower money because uh, we are everything beyond ourselves uh, that we indigenously we are doing. And also that we are planning very well. So, always that is, uh, this is our style of functioning, the style of expenditure. So, only when Others are telling that we have spent less than only we are, we are feeling. Otherwise, we are, uh, this is our uh, way of uh, uh, the, the spending money. Yeah. Right, Mr. Sivan, and your last question before we let you go. The mission, the moment of truth, the moment of reckoning is uh, imminent. It's uh, going to arrive very soon, sir. Any areas, any concerns that you are apprehensive about right now, sir? No, right now it is not so. Yes, uh, everything is uh, going normal. All the parameters also are showing very normal. And uh, we have uploaded all the required data to the Chandrayaan 2. So we are expecting or we are waiting for the moment to happen and we are uh, expecting the re a great success for this mission. So, thank you very much. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.